Sun. Gretel loved reading fairy tales. One day, while she was reading, Hansel asked, What are you reading, Gretel? I'm reading the gingerbread man story. How he runs fast and nobody can catch him. Yes, I know it. I read this tale too. I wish I could meet him. Haven't you heard? Gingerbread man is going to run in the spring race. Gretel was delighted with this news. Really? Let's join the race. It will be nice to meet him and race against him. Sounds good. We'd also be exercising. The Wicked Swamp Witch also found out that the gingerbread man was going to be in the race. It will be very nice to have gingerbread man for five o'clock tea. <laughs> Hansel and Gretel went to town to join and watch the race and met the gingerbread man. I'm so happy you're here. I love your tales. The gingerbread man introduced them to his siblings. Nice to meet you. This is Almond Cookie Girl and this is Chocolate Cookie Man. My brother and sister will join the race too. Great! I'm Gretel. This is my brother, Hansel. We are happy to meet you. Of course, Swamp Witch was there too. So, Gingerbread Man brought his siblings too. How nice I will feast on cookies. And the race started. Gingerbread Man was shouting while running. I'm Gingerbread Man! Nobody can beat me! His siblings were also running fast. Hansel and Gretel were left behind. They run very fast. It's hard to catch up. No biggie. It's still nice to compete against them. Meanwhile, Swamp Witch was hiding and waiting. Come here, little cookies. But the witch's first move failed. Dang! Come here, don't run. I can't miss those other two. The witch will catch you. Run, run! Jump! Okay, now you're in my hands. Oh no! She caught them! I'll catch you too, gingerbread man. I will eat you all. Hansel and Gretel were coming from behind and saw what happened in front of them. Oh! It's the witch! She caught gingerbread man's siblings! Let's save them! When the witch realised that Hansel and Gretel were approaching, she stopped trying to catch Gingerbread Man. These will be enough for five o'clock tea. Let me escape before I get caught by those two. Gingerbread Man was very sad. The witch will eat my siblings if I don't save them. Hansel and Gretel were very sad for Gingerbread Man. They decided to help him. Don't worry, Gingerbread Man. We will save them. But first, they had to find out more about the witch and where she lived. I have never seen this witch before. Where does she come from? An owl perched on a branch told the children that she was a swamp witch and lived there. Hmm, so this witch lives in the swamp. Let's hurry and save the cookie siblings from that wicked witch! Finally, after a very long walk, they reached the swamp. That ivy house is probably hers. Gingerbread Man was worried as time was running out. We must save them before her five o'clock tea! 
Inside, the witch was busy preparing her tea. <laughs> I'll taste you in a moment. <laughs> The children were trying to find a way to save the gingerbread siblings. How do we save them? Hansel immediately thought of something. Here's the plan. Gingerbread man, you'll get the witch's attention. When she comes out to catch you, we... He explained his plan to Gretel and gingerbread man. Okay, do you understand? Yes, yes okay. okay, we got we it. Got it. Meanwhile, the witch was getting ready to drink her tea. Come here, almond cookie. Let me taste you first. Oh no! She will eat my sister! Get your attention! Hurry! Hey, witch! Look, I'm here! Leave my siblings alone! What's all that shouting? Who is yelling? I'm telling you, let them go or I'll destroy you! Oh, you came. Nice. I'll have another cookie now. Ha 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 Come on, Hansel, tie her up! Oh no, Hansel! So you were gonna tie me up, huh? The swamp is waiting for you to swallow you. No, please don't! The Wicked Witch had completely forgotten about someone. Gingerbread Man. Help! Save me! Quick! Let's save Hansel! Okay, let's get the cookie siblings. I saved you! Yuppie! We are final free! I wouldn't have been able to save them without your help. Thank you! Get me out of here! Help! Let it be a lesson to you. I hope you never do evil again. And so they happily made their way home. After Hansel and Gretel got rid of the witch, they lived a pleasant life with their father. But they still wondered about her whereabouts. They always talked about it when they went to bed at night. What are you thinking about, Hansel? The same thing again? Yes, the witch's treasure haunts me. I wonder where she got so much gold. I like to know that too. Maybe. There's a way to find out. Is that so? What is it? We can go to the witch's house and look for clues. I really don't want to go to that house again. We must learn about the source of our treasure. When the children arrived at the house, it was no longer what it used to be. Ah, wasn't it a gingerbread house made of cake? What is this horrible thing? It was a spell she cast to trick children. When the witch disappeared, so did her spell. Hansel and Gretel went inside. They looked around to find out where the witch got the gold. I found something! It's a map. And it has a text below. Elf sleeve 
Under the rainbow where jewel filled pots overflow. Wow, who are the elves? Where is this country? There's a mocked place on the map. It must be there. Someone is at the door. Who are you guys? Hey, don't run! I guess they were afraid of us. I wonder what's in them. Ah, they're filled with gold! These must be the elves mentioned on the map. What are we going to do? Let's go to the country marked on the map. I think the answer lies there. The forest is a scary place at night. I wish we never came! We can't turn back now. We'll go on our way in the morning. I heard something. Could it be a wild animal? The children were scared. They looked around, but they couldn't see anything. Don't be afraid. It's probably just a squirrel. When the sun rose, they set off again. There, how beautiful! Wow! It's the rainbow mentioned on the map. The land of the elves must be there. When they were just on the road again. Oh no! We got trapped! These are the elves who ran away from us. Let us go! I'm afraid, what are we going to do? The elves took them directly to their village. When Hansel and Gretel saw the golden village, they were surprised. Wow! Look at all these houses. They're all made of gold. What will they do to us? Finally, they were brought to a beautiful elf lady with a crown on her head. I am the Queen of the Rainbow Country. It is a serious offence to enter our country. You will be on trial tomorrow. Oh. In the evening, the children were sitting in the cage, brooding over what had happened. How do we get out of here? Don't worry, Gretel. The Queen doesn't look like a bad person. When we explain, she will understand. The next day, the children were taken in front of the Queen and were put on trial. So you came here stealthily to steal our gold? No, we're not here to steal your gold. We just... So why did you come? To kidnap our children? Why would we kidnap them? To take them to the witch, of course. You had the map. You are guilty. But you don't understand. We... Hush! Don't deny it. I sentence you to swift floor in the stone mill for life. We are not guilty, please! They don't look like naughty children, my queen. We should listen to them. Tell us then, why did you have the witch's map? Hansel and Gretel explained everything to the queen, what had happened and why they came to Elfland. Hmm, so the witch imprisoned you in her house, but you escaped? Then we found a map in her house. And these curious children came this far. The queen believed the children's story and found them innocent. She told them how the witch got the gold. If we didn't send her gold, she would take our children. She gathered so much gold from us, she became rich. This is why you are leaving gold at our door. You no longer have to send any. Your children are safe. Are they safe? But how? Because the witch disappeared. She can no longer harm anyone. The queen and the elves were delighted when they heard this news. We got rid of the witch. Yay! Yay!
Finally, it was time for the children to go back. We owe you. Take this gold as our gift. Thank, Thank you. you. Bye. Goodbye. They went home happily, knowing they had made new friends.